All right, y'all. So I just came across this article on TMZ. I had to read it to you guys. It's very interesting. They posted on February 22nd of 2018 titled Kylie Jenner Snapchat tweet might have cost Snap $1.3 billion. Here's what they wrote. Kylie Jenner's being, uh, you know, the B word ching about Snapchat might have inadvertently inflicted some pain in Snapchat's pockets. The reality star tweeted Wednesday saying she doesn't use the social media app at all or much as she did before. And less than 24 hours after that tweet, Snapchat shares tanked by as much as 7.2%, equaling a whopping $7.3 billion loss. Coincidence? So here's what Kylie said on February 21st of 2018 on Twitter. She said, so does anyone else not open Snapchat anymore? Or is it just me? Oh, this is so sad. Kylie, I'm with you. I haven't opened Snapchat in forever either. Because it's just so... It's ignorant. I'm sorry, y'all. I don't understand Snapchat. Anyways, the article goes on to say, No one can say for sure that her tweet caused the domino effect. But Kylie does have a massive influence in that includes me. Uh, she has a combined 128.5 followers on Twitter and Instagram. I follow her on both because she, she's so lit and stays posting awesome stuff. Love Kylie. Anyways, uh, I, co I follow her and her sisters on Twitter and Instagram because I'm a huge Kardashian and Jenner fan for life. Kardashian, Jenner, West fan. Anyways, and I, I'm not even going to get into uh, how I want to marry her best friend Jordan Woods and become part of the family. Uh, all right, y'all. Uh, back, back, back to the TV article. No one <laughs> can say for sure that her tweet caused the domino effect, but Kylie does have a massive influence. She has a combined 128.5 million followers on Twitter and Instagram. Uh, Snapchat's coveted demographic, 18 to 34 year olds. But analysis point to Snapchat's recent app design for Snapchat's decline in active users who hate the redesign and forced Snapchat to rethink things. For what it's worth, Kylie tweeted 11 minutes later professing her love for snapchat too little too late here's the deal kylie has the juice listen kylie has the juice to let the beast loose let me tell you something my girl kylie jenner is a genius man and um you know the kardashians in the west are just and the jenners are just they're everything y'all very intelligent beautiful awesome people and um Everybody knows, man. I I I I love. I I I I I I love the family, man. They are America's royal family. You know, Kylie Jenner is basically the princess of America, and um, I I just uh, wow, man. Uh, they're just awesome people, and um, if Kylie said I quit Snapchat today, I would quit because I I would just delete it completely, um. Kylie's everything, y'all. All right, man, I got to go. I got to go. I, I can't even begin to tell y'all how big of a fan I am of Kylie and the rest of the clan, y'all. They're, they're just everything. All right, y'all. Um, Let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter, Meat Magazine, Meat Magazine 7 on Google+, Meat Magazine blog on Instagram. Hit the notification button. It's right next to the subscribe button. Looks like a bell. Once you click that button, you'll be similar to be notified when the videos get posted. Jesus. Do you guys use Snapchat? If so, what's your favorite social media application? Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram, Face Crook. I mean, Facebook. What's your favorite? And what do you guys think about Snapchat specifically? Or if you feel like saying what you say about every one of them, or maybe you like another one and you want to give a detailed explanation of why it's so great or so crappy, whatever, you know. But uh, Snapchat just doesn't do it for me. Because it's confusing and mm, it, it doesn't have the features that I need to use to do what I personally need to do. It doesn't really benefit me much. It's not really, um, it, it, it's not my favorite. But I am on Instagram and Twitter. Meat Magazine blog on Instagram. Just plain old Meat Magazine on Twitter.